just another warning that your data isn't necessarily as private as you think it is. A simple WhatsApp security flaw exposed 3.5 billion, with a B, phone numbers. By plugging tens of billions of phone numbers into WhatsApp's contact discovery tool, and fortunately it was researchers rather than hackers, found the most extensive exposure of phone numbers ever, along with profile photos and a lot more. So these researchers have shown once again that by plugging in every possible telephone number, they were able to extract 3.5 billion users' phone numbers from the messaging service. Despite a previous warning about WhatsApp's exposure of this data from a different research in 2017, Meta failed to limit the speed or number of contact discovery requests the researchers could make by interacting with WhatsApp's browser-based app, allowing them to check roughly 100 million numbers an hour. So the result of this could have been the largest data leak in history if it wasn't for the fact that this was a responsibly conducted research study. Now WhatsApp's mass adoption stems in part from how easy it is to find a new contact on the messaging platform, add someone's phone number and WhatsApp instantly shows whether they on the service and often shows their profile picture and name as well. So repeat that same trick a few billion times with every possible phone number and guess what? The same feature can also serve as a convenient way to obtain the cell number of virtually every WhatsApp user on earth along with, in many cases, their profile photos and text that identifies each of those users. The result is a sprawling exposure of personal information for a significant fraction of the world population. So if you're on WhatsApp, your data has probably been found by these researchers. The researchers have described this in their paper, hey there, you're using WhatsApp, enumerating 3 billion accounts for security and privacy. They show here as an example, how they were able to extract profile pictures and they show Android versus iOS for the 3.5 billion users as an example. Here you can see a picture of WhatsApp use per capita at 95% in South America and 80% in Europe. So a majority of citizens in those areas have a WhatsApp account and they were able to get a lot of information about many people in certain parts of the world. So what are your thoughts about this? Do you use WhatsApp? Do you trust Meta with your information? or do you use a more private messaging system like Signal, or do you just use iMessage? What's your preferred messaging platform?